So a lovely hello to all my 10th kids. So look at the screen. I have come up with very interesting, cool and conceptual question of quadratic equation. I'll be giving you a short trick, a very easy method. Question is x equals to under root 2 plus, under root 2 plus, under root 2 plus and so on till infinity. It indicates that, infinity indicates that the number of root 2 is large number. Even we cannot count them. There are large number of root 2 are here because the root 2 is going towards the infinity. So in such question, what you should do what you have to do is squaring both sides so if I squaring both sides so what will be the function the function will be like x square and squaring rh side the square of uppermost root the uppermost root will be eliminated so uppermost root will be removed so and uh, only root 2 will be there and these root will be remain same so root 2 plus root 2 again I am writing one more root 2 because the number of root 2 is very large number till infinity so we can we can write even 4 root 2 5 root 2 whatever we want okay so look at the format here x square equals to 2 plus and look at this function look at this family here this family is just look like at, as x so this can be this can be replaced from this x because here the number of root 2 is also again infinite and here the number of root 2 is again infinite so what you need to do you need to replace this whole family from x so this will be like this so x square we can shift these two term here this side so x square minus 2 equals to 0 so look at the look at the format here this is the quadratic equation and you know how to solve quadratic equation you can apply here you can apply here middle term splitting method which is also called factorization method so by solving this by middle term splitting method x minus 2 equals to 0 now open the bracket minus 2x minus minus plus x minus 2 equals to 0 on taking common x minus 2 we are getting bracket x minus 2 so we have to take 1 as common here because both the bracket must be equal to each other so x plus 1 we are getting and x minus 2 here so x equals to minus 1 first value and x equals to positive 2 this is the answer because this is the quadratic equation so there will be two roots there will be two zeros so this is the way how you can solve the question of these formats okay so I'm giving you one question as your homework solve this question and give me the answer in comment section